People began flocking to the harbor front in Tsimsa Chui since early this evening to get the best spots for the much anticipated fireworks display that will usher in 2024. The pyrotechnics return for the first time since 2018, and the extravaganza is said to be the biggest and longest fireworks show the city has ever seen. Metal barriers were set up to prevent revelers from falling into the water. Police were deployed to maintain order and give directions to partygoers. Across the harbor, tents were set up in Tama Park in Admiralty for people to admire the fireworks. In the city's premier entertainment spot of Lan Kwai Fong in Central, crowds began streaming in from early evening. Police installed roadside banners to provide directions as many roads have been closed. And Thea Zhen, director of the Lan Kwai Fong Association, expressed great satisfaction because of full reservations for bars and restaurants. On the eastern side of Hong Kong, a pop-up market with around 100 stalls was set up along the Kun Tong Promenade for people to celebrate New Year's Eve. But coked food stalls were unable to operate for a few hours today due to electrical problems, which also occurred yesterday. This stall operator, who sells grilled skewers and clay pot rice, lost about $10,000 yesterday because his food was spoiled. But he expected to offset his losses and make a profit tonight. At the West Kowloon Cultural District, revelers laid out picnic mats as they waited to say goodbye to 2023. Those returning home after welcoming 2024 will be able to take MTR trains, which will operate overnight. KMB and City Bus have put on extra services, and the trams will not charge anyone until 1 a.m. Maisie Mock, Cable News.